Get to Know Well and Kelly with the Nest SoCal Group at Keller Williams. We are joined today by Heather Rasmussen, who is the owner of Pixie Toys here in Bixby Knowles. And we wanted to have a chat with her today to talk a little bit more about her business and what makes this such an amazing toy store here in the heart of Bixby Knowles. So thank you so much thank for you. joining thank us. For we me. appreciate your time. Um, were you a native of Bixby Knowles area or what brought you to this location? No, so I always grew up in Hermosa, and um, which is really close to here. And when I first wanted to start my business, there was already a toy store, which I had been working at um, in that area. So then we reached out to other areas and you guys didn't have one yet. So oh, yeah, yeah I got so lucky perfect. to find yeah. this place. <laughs> How long have you been here? Um, I have been on Atlantic for 12 plus years, but I started my business in 2007 on Wardlow. Mm, okay. So Long Beach as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. What what kind of toys do you sell here? I've shopped here myself. Yeah. Um, so for I have a five year old son, and I've shopped here for him, many of times for him. But what? Tell us a little bit about the items that you sell here. So I try to choose things that are very different. Um, I do have a lot of things that I remember from my childhood that I enjoyed, and I feel like a lot of other people do too. But what we try to do is, I love themes. So as you can see here, like this is just the unicorn <laughs> theme area, but I have lots of other ones like ocean and dinosaurs. And so we just try to keep it kind of more grouped together so that you can choose a gift that's gonna be unique towards even a theme. I love that you guys offer educational toys. Mm -hmm. And that's something that a lot of toy stores don't offer. They're just more toy centric. Yeah. Um, what made you get into that realm? So um, my kids are actually homeschooled. So okay. I feel like as um, the years went on, I continued to do more things that I would enjoy, like a ton of books um, that are theme related as well, um, that we can study and learn and um, lots of games that you can add into your daily homeschool and or just normal yeah. school life. We heard you just had an event recently um, over the weekend, and of course we were here for the Taste of Bixby Knowles as well, oh, so yeah. it was a busy day yeah, it was. all the way around. Okay. But... So in regard to what makes your approach maybe a little bit more different to other toy stores, we heard you just had an event maybe yeah. um, this past weekend. It was during the Taste of Bixby Knowles, which was a great day. Yeah. Talk about that event and, and what you um, are looking for. So we featured a company called Candy Lab, which it has a lot of food related cars. So we thought it would go perfect with the event that was going on of the Taste of Bixby. So they had a 13 foot ramp where the kids got to design a little derby car and race it down the 13 foot ramp. That's so cool. That's cool. Um, we had a really good success. We ran out of cars actually, um, which next time I think we'll make sure that we have a lot more because <laughs> everybody really loved the event. And um, there was super positive feedback of saying how fun it was for the kids. Um, we also had pizza and a food truck with ice cream in it for the kids. So ours was a free event um, and it, the kids just really enjoyed it. Oh yeah, I thought it was yeah. a great way to bring the kids out in the neighborhood and connect yeah. a lot of parents and, yeah. and I wish I knew about it. Shop cars, yeah. I know, like you would have totally had your yeah. son there. Yeah, you yeah. would have loved it. Um, which brings us to our next question. Um, where do you see the shop in like five years from now? Like what are, you, what are your plans? Um, for me, one of my biggest goals would be to be online. Okay. Um, I haven't done that yet. Um, I've started to build a website, but I also feel that the website needs to be run a certain way and I don't want to mess it up. So I keep like procrastinating on that part. Um, but just more events, more online, um, and then doing more with the community. Yeah, that's great. I think one uh, one last question that I have, um, because you know Amazon is kind of at everybody's fingertips, right? right? You want you want to buy your kids something, you go to Amazon. What makes this a little bit different? What are you doing different? Um, so we have a couple different services. One, we deliver in surrounding areas from the shop. In oh, fact, great. I have delivered closer to El Segundo as well, because that's mm. kind of where I am in the South Bay. So I've done South Bay and Torrance. Um, what makes it different is the fact that we wrap the gift and we put a little card that they can sign because we all know that sometimes the cards as parents get shuffled away. Yeah. Um, so this way um, the package is all unique and set and ready for you to go to the party. So um, the other thing is a lot of parents 
really just come on the way to the party. Yeah. Um, <laughs> just, that would be last me. minute shoppers. <laughs> just roll in, yeah. grab your present, get it wrapped, have your card and everything, and then just go straight to the party. So That's sometimes smart. people really just allow 10 to 15 minutes <laughs> yeah. just to That's get great. your present. Yeah. That's you. That's 100% me. <laughs> um, the other thing that we try to do is a phone call. If you don't have time, we can either pick your gift out for you. Um, if you just tell us an age or how much you okay. wanted to spend, oh, that's really cool. have yeah. it all wrapped and ready for you. We can drop it off to your house or you can just pick it up on your way to your party and um, off you go. Yeah, that's, that's amazing. The personalized yeah. service so you don't get at Amazon. And, yeah. yeah. Sure. And you're supporting a local, local business. business. Like, yeah. that's amazing. Yeah. So, well. What's your favorite part about being in the Bixby Mills area? Um, I think the most important part of this area is how community involved the area is. I feel like all the customers are super supportive. Um, even during when the shutdown, we yeah. made sure that even though our doors were shut, that we were making deliveries somewhat like Amazon yeah. to their doorstep. Um, and so, uh, yeah. That's awesome. Well, That's thank great. you so much yeah, for taking you. time. And it's thank so nice you. to meet you yeah, in person. Yeah. We've <laughs> definitely been in here multiple times. I always see your mom. Yeah. 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 You know, I've been here with Zach all the time. We go to So Me, So Me. And then we come here. It's like a ritual. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. love that. But yeah. that's what's fun about being local. And it's such a Main Street feel here that yeah. this is, you have to have a toy shop. Yeah. And yours is the best. That's yeah. awesome. Oh, thank Thanks you. so much so for nice. doing this with us today. Thank yeah. you. That was quick and easy. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thanks. Bye.